Listing Diario Editorial for February 23rd of 2022. Inflation hits hard. There is no sector of national life that is free from the ravages of the inflation pandemic. That is the reason why the prices of products, whether or not they are essential, as well as services, whether formal or informal, are on the rise. In a context like this, the first thing that is at risk is the social economic stability of the country, which becomes fragile in the face of pressure from citizens as consumers so that the government alleviates their calamity. With this mish acquisition power with salaries that are not enough to satisfy what was previously achieved with a stable budget, the scarcity of food, medicine, means of transportation, energy and services, the challenge of a government and a society acting together is to prevent the situation from becoming catastrophic. Undoubtedly, it is urgent that the government define an urgent program that favors, above all, massive support for agricultural production and construction, two strong generators of employment. The country has to strengthen its capacity to feed itself without relying too much on imports that weaken the base of production and carefully manage the restrictive policies of circulating money to give a cold blow to the escalation. The next appearance of President Luis Abinader before the National Assembly to account for the government's management in 2021 might be the appropriate scenario for urgently defining new lines of combat against inflation and champion with it a society that has to first test its capacity for resistance and sacrifice as it has done in two years of the pandemic so that we never lose the privilege of living in a country in stability, peace and direction, Frank Towers Recovery. For Listing Diario, voiceover and translations by Indira Rodriguez.